All right, nice and straight. January, oh gosh, is it 20th or 29th? No, 29th. January 29th, 2016, day 35, I believe. Uh, let's see. Penny challenge going good. Dime ch challenge going good. Uh, the other news for today. Uh, not sure how I feel about this. Which is my gram came home today. Which I'm happy for. And she's not at a nursing home anymore. Uh, but she gets very frustrated easily. Um, oh, I'll put a penny aside for that. Every time I say that word. She... <sighs> She's not used to my niece who is handicapped and can always go, Mimi, 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 pick it off, pick it off, pick it off. You know, like, it'll annoy you. And we'll see how long it lasts. It's definitely different having four people in this house now. I will say that. Um, there we go again. I'm happy my gram is home and not, you know, dead or anything because I really thought she was going to die last fall. I really thought so. In the past six months, like, she just was not doing good. And now she's done a 180 and she's home. So, uh, we'll see how that goes. But, uh, she's definitely different from when she used to be my gram, you know, back in the day. She pretty much tells everybody everything. Not that, you know, we already don't do that. I mean, everybody does it. She does it more where she will... I feel like she'll make our family try to be at each other's throats. So we will see about that. I am happy that she's home, but yeah. Uh, today work went well. I got a sizzler, put Doritos on it. It's actually pretty good. Not too bad for what I got today. Uh, sizzler is basically, they heat up a pita. They, uh, I had them put Doritos down first, which it was the nacho cheese ones. Put chicken on top of that, honey mustard. I had lettuce, tomato, onions. Was that it? I think that was it. Oh, and cheese. It's really good. I I saw students doing this, and I'm like, okay, I need to try it. Uh, work is good. I had a short day. I got some stuff done, did an update on the work phone. So I don't have to worry about that. It is my weekend off from home health care. Yay for that. Uh, right now, I don't have any hours for the nursing home tomorrow which is okay unless they call me and I'll go in for a little bit why not and I work Sunday through Friday so work is good I'm okay uh the whole thing about yesterday and why I was kind of down I like someone at work but I don't pursue it because I just don't and his type is skinny skinny women Basically, I'm like, he just wants a skinny freakazoid, fake blonde, fake person. And as much as he wants, if he wants that, that's great. That's him. It just kind of brings me down because it's like I'm never good enough. I will never be good enough for anybody. It doesn't matter who I've dated in the past and all that. It just sucks because it basically tells me I'm not going to be good enough. Ever. I am happy that I'm single. Like, don't get me wrong. I love it. And I'm finally getting back to being some kind of normal before my last ex. Took me over, nearly over two years for that. Where I'm back to normal and not thinking so awful of myself. I still think crap about myself because I'm my family tends to put me down so much. But, you know, from my ex, it's taken me a good at least two years to get back to what I was before I started dating him. And we dated for nearly two years. So there's two years of emotional and mental damage that he did. And it took another two years. So four years nearly of just trying to get back to who I am and all that. I am trying to be happier. It's definitely going to be one hell of a road. Tough road at least. So uh, since this video is almost five minutes long, I'm going to end it. I wanted to do one early today. And, uh, today's weather is a little weird, but it, hey, it's not too bad out. So, I'm going to relax. I'm going to watch some Once Upon a Time. You guys have a great night, and I will update tomorrow. Thank you for watching, and have a great day wherever you are.